Previously on Pokemon Sword. Bar. Barbaraco. Okay. I think this one's water type. Oh no. See what you got, Mr. Rhyme. No one can stop us. What's going to be his appearance? This is the first time I've been seeing it. Wow. Looks really big now. I mean, it's so big now. <laughs> Hello, YouTube. So, we are now off to continue our journey. In Pokemon Sword. During our last episode, Sony asked us to meet at a certain restaurant, and I think this is it. Okay, it's here. Pop is also here. I've been trying to find out more about the Darkest Day in the Sword and Shield Pokemon. But still no luck. Hmm. That's interesting. Another tapestry? No way. What's this? Hmm. A new chapter in the old gallery le legends. A fifth tapestry. An absolute fantastic poster. Definitely not this third option. Let's go with 5th Tapestry. The heroes look sad. Where are the sword and shield? What was the meaning of this picture? Hmm. Probably the end to the legend? Perhaps when their duty was completed, they went into some kind of sleep? Based on those statues we saw back in Stone Side, the sword and the shield were actually two Pokemon, right? That's right. That's my stake on it, at least. Do you remember the Pokemon we met that day? Do you think it could have been one of them? Either the sword or the shield Pokemon? You met them? Oh yeah, during that... In the forest? In the forest. In the forest. Come on, you know what I'm talking about, right, Kindred? Nah, in the slumbering wild. Slumbering wild. We're talking about that. The mad Pokemon we ran into in the fog. Don't you think that could have been it? Oh, that's right. You would have been in the slumbering wild. I only started on this journey because my grand told me to. But this is turning out to be too much fun. You've got to tell me more. How about we discuss this over a meal? Go on, what do you want to eat? Let's get our orders in. Guess we're gonna talk about the legend. Or done already. Done already. Fascinating. Alright, the next thing to do now that we're done eating is to have a look around Sir Chester. Let's inspect the hero's bath. Time to go. The hero's bath. They say this is where the two heroes came to soothe their wounds after the battle to bring down that evil presence long ago. Nowadays, only Pokemon really used the hero's bath though. Hmm, who exactly were the heroes that bath here? I think I'll have to look into that. You two met a mysterious Pokemon back in Slumbering Wild. Perhaps you two can become new heroes. Hmm, is that possible, Sonia? What? Like some hero waving around a sword and shield? Pull the other one. Though, I guess I'd fancy a shield if I had to take my pick. What kind of battle do you think the heroes had back then? 
Why don't we show her, Kindred? Think we can pull off a real, a real heroic battle? Not. I see now. Haven't even heard my Parsi, but whatever. Sure. So Jira does to a great meal. After that, Curry, I feel like I've got the energy to wrestle a beware. I don't entirely understand your reasoning, but I might just as well see what you can do. I'll heal up your Pokemon for you, Kindred. So give it your best. This is the first one in my party. Time for a little exhibition match, starring the future champion. Back with your confidence up, huh? Double? Oh, the evolved form of Wulu? Okay, so we have Colossal as our first Pokemon. So you brought back double on your part on your party let's go with stealth rock first hmm defense curl both of us are going to be buffeted by hail hmm. let's go with flame charge i guess gonna keep on doing the friends girl it's going to take a while to faint it's gonna take a while to faint because Karkul's moveset is plain physical attack well at least he can resist the attacks from double assuming it only has normal type moves we're just gonna keep on increasing our speed with flame charge. And it used growl. I hope you are aware, Hop, that when I switch yeah, which Colossal all those growls should have been for naught should just focus on attacking to be honest oh great you used a hyper potion on double it's gonna make it even more bulky uh huh I think it's time for me to switch I've run it. had enough of this game. We have Mr. Rhyme. Oh good, we have Mr. Rhyme. Mr. Rhyme and Wheezing. Mm -hmm. But double. Uh, it targets... Defense that, so let's go with... Wait. Fine, let's go with Wheezing. Or Sir Duck. Let's go with Sir Duck. I don't even have Grodd with me. We don't have our starter Pokemon with us. I think we can bypass through... through the stat changes if we land a critical hit. Let's see. But let's use Focus Energy first before using Brick Break. How many defense curls are you planning to do? Is that your strategy? Keep on using defense curl and then you know Pokemon's HP is in critical you use hyper potion. Let's see if we can deal huge damage with Brick Break. Okay. Critical hit ignores stat changes, I believe. I mean, I don't think we would be able to faint double in one hit without a critical hit. And if critical hit counts, the stat changes. Okay, flying and steel type. Not the best matchup for Sir Duck. 
-hmm. Let's try. Product move first. Critical hit. Are you going to use drill pack? Okay, drill pack. Well. Corbinite still flying. Guess we can send back Colossal. That's okay. That's okay because Colossal is not to be not to be meant fast. Not to mention we can cancel the stat changes but just by using two flame charge. Just by using two flame charges. Intellion. We need to switch. It's going to one hit Colossal. Intellion targets special defense. That Pokemon has high special attack and high speed. So let's go with Mr. Rhyme who has high special defense stat. Snipe shot. Snipe shot. Mr. Rhyme should be able to take it. Nice. And we have leftovers to further further bulk Mr. Mime. Mr. Rhyme. Let's go with side beam. Oh, I forgot about that one. I forgot about that one. Okay, it got confused. Good. Let me use lack off. In case it decides to use snipe shot. I hope Mr. Mr. Rhyme can withstand one more one more snipe shot. Oh liquidation. Damn. I actually targeted my lower lower stat. Mixed sweeper? Hop. You're learning. Alright, let's go with Kindred now. And there we go. I think you still have two Pokemon left. You still have two, right? Uh huh. What is this Pokemon type? I forgot. Let's go with Rock Tomb. Actually, let's just go with Crunch and see if yourselves. Defense fell from Crunch. Curse. Okay, this is going to increase its attack and defense not by one stage, but decrease speed by one stage. Let's just. Use crunch all the way. Who's going to be your last Pokemon? Not even close. Let's see what you got. You have a Snorlax. You have a Snorlax. Interesting. Anyway, I'm going to hit you with your... Anyway, Snorlax has higher special defense stat. And we are using Kindred now with a high attack stat. So we should be good. Let's go with... Crunch. Just keep on going with Crunch. Maximize that tough jaw ability. Happy Slam, that's still type. But it's going to deal neutral damage to Kindred now because because this Pokemon is part water type. 
finish it with Razor Shell. Razor Shell will always remind me of Oshawott. <laughs> I still can't even beat you, my true rival. But I think I'm starting to see the light. And we got 9000 from that battle. Not a bad battle, to be honest. Thanks, you two gave a right proper battle. At the rate you both are going, even the unbeatable Leon may be in trouble. So what's next, you two? I plan to look into the things in the slumbering wield. I'm going to keep challenging that gym. Then, once I get that gym badge, I'll be heading for Route 9 to take on Spike Moth next. So that's where our 7th badge is going to be, I think. Seems like he finally shook off that gloom. Leon be Leon'd worry if Hop wasn't feeling alright. As his rival, you wouldn't like it either, right? See ya! That's it? That's it. Okay. Guess we should also go to to where Hop is going. Uh huh. Where Hop is going next? First things first. Pokemon Center. How about we check Sonya on Slumbering World? Maybe discover something. Yeah, let's check on her first. But first, let's switch our party. Nope, nope. Not the bicycle. I'm pressing the wrong button. Uh huh. Go to the boxes. Injured is already level 43. Also, need Grud back in. How about Corvi Knight? Well, this guy has a high defense stat. Already have. Two Pokemon with that, Berserker and Wazing. I don't think we still need to use Corvinet, so let's go with Sir Rhyme, Wazing, Sir Da, Colossal. Take the bench, Colossal. And let's place. Okay, Gyarados, Grod, Mr. Rhyme, Berserker, Wazing, Sir Da. Mm, let's sub or beetle for Mr. Rhyme. Anything else? We may need Eldegoss for catching Pokemon, so let's switch Sir Doc. Nah, let's switch Berserker. Okay, so for the items, move the amulet coin to Gyarados and then leftovers to. Hmm. Aldegas. Shell Belt or Beetle. Yeah, that should be good. Then item check. You can purchase more items. What else? You have 18 Pokeballs, so let's buy 12. And yeah, let's buy 10. 10 for the Premier Ball. Mmm. Alright, let's use repel. Nothing else here. Okay, let's check Slumbering Wield first. Might as well visit mom. Let's visit mom. Okay, I can fly directly there. Postwick. Okay, so we can't enter here. Never mind. Let's check on mom. How is she doing? Hello, Munchlax. Still sleeping, I see. Hey, mom. Okay, that's it. See you again, mom. <laughs> back to our adventure. Let's fly back to Sir Chester and we will be heading to Spike Muth next. Route 9. But before Spike Moth, we will be passing through Route 9.
What adventure awaits us here? What Pokemon awaits us here? We will see. I have a feeling a lot of Pokemon here are going to be Ice type. So, well, Orbital is Bug and Psychic type. We can take those. Mm -hmm. Wait, we can fish. I think. Wonder what we're gonna catch here. Auxiliary! Okay, let's catch him. Let's catch let's catch this guy. Okay, we caught it by using a single Pokeball. Another Pokemon added to our Pokedex data. I think I saw another here. But I will need to battle this trainer first. And let me restore our Beatles HP first. And let me switch Gyarados. Once you earn double the money with the amulet coin. Fisher, hurry it. Oh, you have Brascuda. I think this Pokemon has a high attack and high speed set. Wait. You have two Pokemon. Uh huh. Perhaps you can use Dragon Dance once and then Crunch. Ah, watch it. It's gonna deal a little damage, especially after Intimidate. Dragon Dance will increase Gyarados attack and speed type. Attack and speed by one stage. And now use Crunch. It also has Crunch. Who has a stronger Crunch? Gyarados has. Using now level 43. Look at that defense stat. Oh boy. Mmm, Lantern. Should we switch? Gyarados will go down with a single... Single Spark or Thunderbolt. Mmm. I have a feeling we should switch. What level is Lantern? 39. Nope. He won't be able to take it down with one Waterfall. And if I remember correctly, Lantern has... Lantern is relatively, bar relatively bulky. Let's see if it will use Spike or Thunderbolt. Hmm? Confused Ray. Guess I should have just stayed. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> it's okay. This is okay. Should be able to take it out with one drum beating. But unfortunately... Okay, still a good decision that we switched Gyarados out. Or rather, we switched, we switched him back for Grodd. Come on! Hit hit! Okay. I can't remember Lantern's stat exactly. I know it has quite high HP. Prob also probably high uh, high special defense. Anyway, let's see what we can what Pokemon can we fish from here. Hope it's a different one. Not another auxiliary. Remoraid? No, okay. It's Wishy Washy. Another Pokemon from Gen from Gen 7.
Are you actually difficult to catch? How'd you get out of that critical catch? <laughs> and that's another one added to our Pokedex. Okay, nothing more here. Okay, I think... Do we... Do we have Pelipper? I can't remember if we already have Pelipper. Anyway, let's see. I'm planning to catch a Pelipper, but we will need to restore Eldegoss HP first. Can't remember. I don't think we have Pelipper. Might as well catch. Oh, do you have the drizzle ability? You're dead. You're dead. It's a pain catching Pokemon in... in hail weather. It's a pain. Really. So I should save the catching for later. And there's a lot of Toxapex there, I'm sure. I can come back later. No need to restore Gyarados HP. Let's battle this. Dancer Zoe. Jarumaka? I think that's Ice type. Okay, that's Ice type. <laughs> How many Pokemon do you have? Two? Two. Let's use Dragon Dance once. Just once. One should be enough to switch this Pokemon and the next Pokemon. going to be your next Pokemon. Hmm. Blossom. Rest type so we can use Ice Fang. Ice Fang. Level 41, Gyarados. gonna continue down here I'm sure there's going to be another trainer Sir Chester Bay hmm. okay team yell what are you guys planning again what are you guys planning there's no way we're letting you anywhere near spike moth and that means we can't let you go Go on to Route 9. It's Team Yell's duty to cheer on this lovely Dreadnought. Seriously? And we also get to stop people from heading out over the water. It's going to be another battle, I believe. All I'm saying is that I can make it so that Rotom bikes can ride on water. Hmm, I guess we're gonna get that ability here. The ability to go to bike on water. Okay, fine. I'll give you a battle. That's that's what you want, Team Yell. Hmm, level thirty-nine. One dragon dance, and proceed to sweep with waterfall. Whoopsie. <laughs> Whoopsie doopsie. If you can withstand this and then use counter, then Gyarados is sure to faint. But you cannot. Oh, 
Oh, who is next? Pangoro. Panda Bear. Bullet Punch. Not very effective. Steel against water is not very effective. Wait, 1 HP? Wow. But thanks to the hill. <laughs> Thank you, Hill, for fainting Pangora for me. I think there's going to be another battle. There's another team yell grunt here. Oi, I've got an idea. We can get on Dredno first and ride it away. Alright, get a move on, Dredno. See you later, Gym Challenger. Seriously? You're gonna ride that guy? <laughs> See if you've come to my aid yet again. How's the cycling life been treating you? Are you having fun? Wouldn't it be great if you could ride your Rosam bike on the water too? That's why I'm going to add these special parts, allowing it to travel along the water surface. Just for you. Mm, thank you. This bike can be combined with a Pokemon Rotom to not only do a turbo boost but also run on the water. Wow. Touch technology Pokemon. By the way, when you're landing on land, we call it land mode. Okay. So we really need... Hmm. What, what kind of Pokemon is that? <laughs> um, I may need to prepare myself. Let me catch that guy. Uh-huh. Wait. Okay, I need to try. Oh! I can ride it directly. We have a lot of new Pokemon to catch here. And here we have a Mantike. It's gonna faint Eldegoss, but that's also going to faint you, Mantike. Yep. I'm doing the catching... later. I'm doing the catching later. Hail is such a pain. Hail is such a pain to deal with when catching Pokemon. Okay, let's see if we can find an item here. No! You refuse to be caught anyway. Forget it. Forget it. Not interested in catching you. No, 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 no. Any item here? The Wilmer. Mm hmm. Double battle? Or no? No? Not battle? Secret bitch? What present? Oh nice! We got a CM45 dive! I mean, I just don't understand how you guys can withstand the cold. They're just wearing... They're just only wearing a bikini and not wearing any shirt. How can you withstand the cold? Oops, okay. Pokemon battle. Grab lock. Okay, it's that Pokemon I saw earlier. Are you related to Octillery by any chance? Why do I get the feeling you are fighting type? Water fighting type? Level 41. It... Mm. Okay, definitely fighting type. Guess we should just use Waterfall. Just use waterfall. We should deal. Okay. Uh huh. Neutral damage. So you're not water type. You're only fighting type. 
Oh, come. <laughs> I mean, with, with your... With that Pokemon color and appearance, you are sure to think that it's a water Pokemon. Water type Pokemon. Okay. What else do we have here? Besides... The female giving us TM45. Max Revive. I think I just saw some... I just saw a Pokemon there. Okay, another battle. You can also camp here, huh? Take him on. See what Pokemon he has. Black Belt Reese. Sock. Okay. So do you have one Pokemon or two? If you only have one, then you will need for me to use Dragon Dance. You have two Pokemon. So much for that. <laughs> Actually, I'm not sure if I can faint it with just one waterfall. With a plus one from Dragon Dance. But well, let's see. Let's see. Okay, good. Great job, Gyarados. As expected. Missing is now level 44. Nope. Don't need Belch. Soft and throw. Okay, so this one is bulkier than soft. For switch? Nope, okay. Don't tell me you have a bullet punch or something. Nope. Orbital now, level 42. Need more training. Just rare candy. Hello! Rumor has it that there is a camping king somewhere in the wild area. Have you seen him? He changed the color of your tent and rates your curry decks. I think I have seen that guy before. Shall we cook? Nah. Okay, Toxapex, Toxapex. What is that Pokemon? Is that the pre evo of fighting type Pokemon we fought earlier? Another battle. <laughs> Let's switch to Orbital. Fisher Marina. Quillfish. Quillfish, the Pokemon that is so difficult to catch. Is super effective. Good. Quick decision switching to Orbital. Made a battle quick. Oh, do you have another one? Yukumuku. Just continue on using Psychic. Just neutral damage. Counter? That's not gonna do anything. You guys keep on using counter. Pick your favorite move. Take the shell belt that will restore some of Orbital's HP.
in our south. Okay, that's gonna hurt our Beasel. It activates when Pukumuku Pukumuku faints. And there goes now level 45. I'm gonna catch those Pokemon later. Hmm, another trainer battle here. Streamer Jacob. It's Cloyster! Cloyster has high defense stat, but low special defense stat. Well, or Beetle doesn't really have a high special attack either. But <laughs> I thought Cloyster can withstand it. Okay, Grad level Grad is now level 45. Let's switch our party first. Mm-hmm. This year I'm 43, 43, 42, can keep Gyarados there, keep Orbital there, switch Grud for Colossal, and Eldegoss. I don't plan on catching any Pokemon yet, so we can switch out Eldegoss for Berserker. And then items... Let's give Orbeezel the amulet coin. So we get double the amount of money. I'm still in the shore. Remoraid. Okay, you have three Pokemon. That's a lot. Good job. One hit Psychic on Remoraid. Man time. Gonna be bulky. Let's just keep on using Psychic. Probably take three Psychic. Or four. Probably four. Four it is. Four or three. Oh boy, that's not good. I may need to switch out. I may need to switch out Orbeezel for. Mm. Iron Head is not gonna deal. Uh huh, Serdak using Air Slash. Fine, let's use Berserker. I mean, I think he can still deal a lot of damage with Iron Head. Fake out first and then Iron Head. Yeah, it, Berserker can definitely, can definitely inflict a lot of damage. Despite being not very effective. Let's see. Oh, who is going to be your last? Tither. be able to paint it in three iron head 
and it flinched. Actually just two, thanks to the hill. I forgot to give Berserker the leftovers. See what berry can we get from here? Maybe rare berries? Wiki berry. One more shake. Hmm, one more. Oh, crap. <laughs> it was a mistake. Let's just <laughs> let's run away from this one. Run away. No, my wiki berries. Okay, nothing more here. Change your tips. Rejects when you throw a Pokeball. Oh, okay, that's the critical capture. Critical catch. No, don't follow me. Your Chester Berry. Protector. Allows Rhydon to evolve to Rhyperior. If you trade if you trade Rhydon while holding the Protector, that is. Seeing a bunch of new Pokemon here. I'll get to you guys later. There's an item. Pearl String. What? We'll do the catching later. Uh, let me check the town map. Where do we need to go? Okay. Left. Southwest. Around southwest. No! Hmm. No! I'm kind of in a hurry right now. Oh, come on. I don't want to battle you right now. here okay okay there's a path here no you no you no you no you rock slide can teach it to another Pokemon battle Streamer Logan. Wishy washy. Oh boy, this is gonna be tough. This is certainly going to be tough for our beetle. Weezing. Or Perserker. Try using hypnosis. Nice, it hit. Okay. We'll use this opportunity to switch to Sir Doc. Orbit is not in a very good shape to battle.
When does the schooling deactivate? I forgot. Is it based on the number of turns? Still have one Pokemon. Damn, you have a Waylord. And it's a small Waylord. <laughs> small Waylord. And it goes down with just single brick break. Hold up, can we check the town map and see how far we still need to go? Then still far. Still gonna be far. We will need to camp first. Camp with these guys. And cook. Uh huh. Menu. Nope. Let's start cooking. We have too many rust berry. We have 22 of citrus. Let's also play some grappa. Two grappa berry. Maybe two. Okay. And then one citrus berry also. How is it gonna taste? What is that secret ingredient? Okay, only two of us. Okay, that should be, that should be enough. Okay. Gotta be careful with the fire. Woohoo, boy. What type of curry is it going is it going to be? Dry season curry. Oh nice, silver. Pokemon Sage Bean PP were restored. Talus conditions were healed. Thank you. Anyway, episode will be ending here guys. The next the next one we will continue our adventure towards right towards Route 9. So see you in the next one.